Hi everyone. Today, we'll be talking about how to create a checklist in your PDF documents using Soda PDF. To create a checklist in a PDF, you'll want to add checkbox form fields to your PDF document. In this example, we'll add checkboxes next to each of these bullet points so that the person who's double checking the HIPAA assurances can keep track of their efforts. The first step in Soda PDF is to add a single checkbox to your document. Then close the checkbox tool. Make sure you're in edit mode and then select your checkbox. You'll be able to open up the properties where you can proceed to head to the appearance section. Here, you can do things like change the border color and if you toggle this to text, you'll be able to update the color of your caption and even choose which icon you'd like to use. Once you've made any changes, click out of your checkbox and then select it again. You'll be able to now choose the make default option. And what this means is when you click to add any new checkboxes to your document, you'll see they all retain the same aesthetic choices you've made. Now that you've created the aesthetic default for your checkboxes, head over to the checkbox feature one more time. And this time, instead of just clicking to place the field, Hold down the left mouse button and drag your cursor until the field is the appropriate size. When you release the mouse button, you'll see your field gets added, but that the preview size has been updated so that each field will match as you continue to click. As you move your mouse cursor, you'll see green dotted lines appear letting you know that each of your checkboxes is fully aligned with the other ones. Once you've added all of your checkboxes, you can click on this X or the checkbox feature to turn it off. Now, head on over to view mode and proceed to click into your checkboxes to make sure that everything is working appropriately. If you want to add future checkboxes to this document and you want to make sure that the size matches perfectly, all you need to do is click on the checkbox feature and add another checkbox. Head over to the Edit tab and click on an existing checkbox. You'll be able to see the height and width options here. We can see that both are set to 0.12 inches. We can now head to any other checkbox and click into this area to update both the height and the width. As you click anywhere else, you'll see the numbers update and the size of the checkbox will now match. When you click on each checkbox, you'll also have the ability to quickly update the form field name so that you can easily keep track of your data should you choose to export it. Well, that's all there is to it, everyone. Let us know in the comments if you found this video helpful. And if you did, like this video and subscribe to this channel for more tutorial videos. Follow us on Twitter and like us on Facebook to stay up to date with everything happening in the world of Soda PDF. Thanks for watching everyone and please have a wonderful day.